Hey guys, back here again for a new video and in this video I'm showing something very very cool that I got in the mail today. Um, as you guys can see from the title you guys know what it is but I wanted to talk a bit about how I got this. I actually got this off of eBay from somebody who I used to follow on YouTube called 8 the chosen one. He was a really really um are a big YouTuber um, in the in the horror community and uh, I used to love his videos because he had such a personality he was super hyper he uh, you know he wore a mask and he just had such a big passion for uh, horror movies and for music and he was just a he was just a, a, a great character you know and uh, he seemed like a really great person as well and he was just um you know like I said he brought so much personality and so much excitement to his videos like every time he got something every time he talked about a movie or a or a box set or something I actually discovered him because I was looking up you know uh, DVD box sets horror DVD box sets on YouTube years ago and one of his videos popped up and he was just so excited and hyper about all the different box sets that he had and um, I started watching his videos he was also a huge Evil Dead fan. Um, his favorite horror movie was Evil Dead 2, and he had a massive Evil Dead 2 uh, collection. And he was just such a, you know, he was just somebody that, you know, I, 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 I followed for a, a while. Um, and he was just such a, you know, like I said, he was always so hyper and so energetic in his videos. And it made you, you know, seeing him so excited about, um, stuff that he had in his collection just made you excited and made you look at your stuff and just get excited about or if you went out and you got something you know uh, you know like a cool box set or a, a cool DVD or Blu-ray release it made you excited um, you know you know just from seeing him get so excited and, and get so um, get so pumped up for his collection it made you get excited as well and um, I really loved his videos and a few years back, he left YouTube, and then he started uh, rapping. And um, I really enjoyed a lot of his rap music. And since then, he's been, you know, he's been doing um, rap albums. Well, recently, he's had some medical problems, and he's had to go through surgery, and he's been needing money for his um, for his surgeries, and um, he's been listing stuff on eBay. And a lot of this stuff is, you know, he, he uh, before he um, went through this, he was getting rid of his stuff. He was downsizing his collection. Um, you know, there, I think there's a point in every collector's um, life where you, you kind of think, you know, do I really need to keep this just for the sake of having it? You know, and, you know, just like me, I've been sort of purging some of my stuff. I've been getting rid of some stuff from my collection as well. So he started doing that. But once, um, once he had uh, the surgery, he started selling off some of his autographs. And some of the stuff is very, very cool. Like he recently put up a uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre poster signed by everybody, Gunnar Hansen, everyone. And I've been, you know, I was looking on his eBay, this, seeing what he had, and I saw this that I'm, I'm going to be showing off in this video. And I really wanted it because... Out of all the Halloween-related autographs you can get, I think that this is the number one autograph that you can get. And as you guys can see from the title, it is John Carpenter's autograph. And as you guys can see, it is on the 30th anniversary commemorative set. This is a set that I've been wanting for a long time, but I never wanted to spend a lot of money on it because I already own everything that's in this set. You know, this set comes with Halloween on Blu-ray and DVD, the uh, TV cut of Halloween, the 25 Years of Terror documentary, and Halloween 4 and 5. So this set itself is not really anything special other than the packaging. You know, I mean, the packaging is, it's a pretty cool set. I'll, I'll show it off real fast. Um, I know that there's other videos showing it off, but it does have, like, the rubber Michael Myers mask on the front. And then it's got a lot of cool um, artwork all the way around. So it is a cool set. It is also numbered, and the number is 907 out of 20,000. Um, so it is a cool set. Here's the inside of it. 
Um, but since I already owned everything that was inside of it, I was never in a real hurry to get this set. But once I saw eight list this, I knew I had to get it. So I'm going to go ahead and move this aside and show you guys exactly what this video is about. And here it is, John Carpenter's autograph. And like I said, guys, John Carpenter is the number one autograph, I think, that you, you can own in the Halloween franchise. I mean, he's director of the original movie. Without him, you know, Halloween wouldn't have happened. And just to have John Carpenter's autograph in my collection is amazing to me. Now, as you can see, it is um, personalized to eight. And I think that a lot of people are sometimes turned off when an autograph, when they see an autograph and it's personalized to a, a certain person, it makes them not want to get this. I think that's the reason why this set didn't go for a lot. It only went for about uh, 50 bucks, which is how much I paid. I was the highest bidder, which I think for this set, I mean, because I don't see this set it's alone go for only $50, but to have this set and to have it signed by John Carpenter for that much is amazing. And I feel like that some people didn't want to get it because it was personalized to eight. But to be honest, I, that adds to it for me because it's not like it's, it's autographed to just somebody random. It's not like it's autographed to, to Jim or to, you know, uh, David or whoever, or to a random person. It's autographed to eight, who is somebody that I looked up to on YouTube. So to me, the fact that it's personalized to eight, you know, it means something more to me uh, because it's personalized to him other than it just being randomly personalized to somebody else. But even if it was personalized to someone else, it's still John Carpenter's autograph. You know, this is, and this is actually his autograph, you know. Um, and this isn't like, you know, eight, you know, I've known eight for, you know, I, I mean, I'm friends with him on Facebook. I followed him. So I know that this autograph is authentic. It's not like it's somebody that, you know, it's like, oh, yeah, it's real. And, you know, because there's, of course, there's so many fakes out there. But I know 100%. This is real. This is John Carpenter's autograph. So, yeah, that is just amazing. Um, for those of you who, I'll just show this set off. I'm sure people have seen this, but for anyone who hasn't seen it, I'll show it off real fast. The actual, you know, it comes with Halloween, the Blu-ray, Halloween on DVD, the extended cut, the 25 Years of Terror documentary, four and five. So the actual set itself, you know, I mean, it doesn't come with anything really new. I've, I remember when the set first came out, you know, it, it was cool to have, you know, both cuts of the movie, the, the Blu-ray and all that together in one set. But the reason why I never jumped on the, I never got this set before was because it was never really a set that had anything really special about it. I wanted the set other than the packaging. I mean, I, I wanted the set. It just wasn't a set that I wanted to spend a lot of money on. And for some reason, this set goes for a lot of money now. But the fact that it was signed by John Carpenter, the, that, the fact that, you know, I got this from 8, so it helped him out. And the fact that I got it for a really good price just is awesome. And I am really glad to help 8 out because he really does, you know, need money. Um, I kind of wish that this set would have gone for a bit more. And I think that it, it might have. But I do know that, like I said, he put up a full-size poster of the Texas Chainsaw Massacre signed by the entire cast, including, of course, Gunnar Hansen. You know, so I think that that is probably, he's probably going to get some good money for that one. Um, so, you know, I do think that, you know, he will get some good money for the stuff that he's selling. And he's selling a lot of stuff, uh, a lot of autograph stuff. It is, everything is personalized, but like I said, the fact that it's personalized to eight just makes it a bit more special. So, yeah, guys. I just wanted to do this video just to show you guys that I now have John Carpenter's autograph in my collection. And like I said, he is the number one for me because, you know, of course, John Carpenter, you know, John Carpenter, you know, he's the director of Halloween. Like, he's the number one autograph that you can get. Next to him, definitely Nick Castle. Definitely um, Jamie Lee Curtis is someone else. You know, I mean, of course, I would love to get their autographs, of course, PJ Souls, Nancy Loomis, anybody that um, had a part in the original movie, I would love to have. But John Carpenter's autograph, that is my number one. That was my number one. And I never wanted to, I never wanted to go on eBay and get one because you never know. There's so many fakes out there. 
but with this, I know it's real. So I just wanted to say thanks to um to eight for putting this up there. I know that you didn't want to you didn't want to sell this because you're going through something right now and you wanted to keep this. And I know it's hard for you to let go of a lot of these autographs, but you know I just wanted to do this video just to let you know it, it's going to a good home, and I really hope that you do get enough money t to help you with your you know with your surgery and whatever you need. So thank you so much, eight. Um, thank you for letting me have the opportunity to get John Connor's autograph. And also this set, like I said, I've been after this set for a while, but the fact that it's signed by John Carpenter is just amazing. So yeah, let me turn this around. So yeah, eight, if you're watching this, thank you very much. Thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think about this. Um, and, um, you know, if you guys are interested, you can go on, e you can go on eBay and see what other stuff he is selling. Um, I will leave a link down below to Eight's um, eBay page because he does have other autograph stuff, um, on there. I don't know how much Halloween stuff he has, but he does have other really cool autograph stuff. So go over there, you know, check it out. And if you see anything, you know, bid on it and, you know, give him a, you know, get him some help, you know, cause he, he does need some help right now. Um, you know, with, like I said, his, you know, what's his, uh, medical issue that's going on. So thank you once again, eight. And I just cannot believe that, um, I have John Carpenter's autograph. So thank you so much, man. Uh, thanks everybody for watching and I'll see you all in the next video.